I'm here today with Brandon Armstrong, the best impersonator in the world, B.A.5. And today we're going to show you guys a little skit, what Brandon does best. And then we're going to talk about how he's gotten here today and a little bit about his MVP trophy from the NBA Celebrity Game. Let's get it. Who are you checking, bro? Who you want? <laughs> I'm going to get a white boy. Which one? <laughs> I'm going to get that fake Clay Thomas. I'm going to get uh, Grace and No Talent. Well, you know I'm not worried, bro. Uh -huh. No, I'm not worried. Oh, God, what's up? Hold on, boy, hold on. It might be the hardest, but don't worry, don't worry, we good. I got his wife, what I'm saying, that's what I'm talking about, bro. That's what I'm talking about, boy. Oh, my God, hold on, man. Right, get right, hold on. God. Come on. What's up, God? I got a fuck, let me go, boy. Kick that. Oh, let's go. Yeah. Mouse in the house. I got this, I got this. He embarrassed me. No, he's not, bro. He only got like four, bro. Uh, Come on, God. What's up, bro? Ain't nothing wrong with your ankle, man. Come on, he got on track, too. I got help, I got help. Oh, yeah. Body, body. That's yeah. what you're talking about. Bro, he stuck his leg up. Man, he killed you, man. Come on, man. Dolly, why you do nothing with the white boy ducked on me, man? Over there, no help defense. How did this phenomenon start? Man, one day I was, you know, I was outside. And I was like, man, I want to do a Russell Westbrook in-game facial expressions be like. It wasn't even a Russell Westbrook be like. And once I did that, it just went crazy. Viral, Russ retweeted it, and it's just history since then. And then what other videos did you do after that? I did a James Harden, um, Tim Duncan. I seen like my followers and my supporters, they really liked it. So I was like, okay, let me, let me keep this thing going. So now you live in LA, and we did a little video together. And uh, you've been doing a lot of influential stuff. What kind of stuff are you doing now? Uh, we do, I, I always play in the charity celebrity games. Um, we have a, a lot of different toy drives, shoe drives with a lot of couple of friends out in Sacramento. So, you know, I just try to, I just try to stay connected to the people that got me where I am today. Man, that's crazy. I saw uh, you played in the NBA Celebrity Game the other day. Got some hardware. Tell us about that. Hey, man, it was, it was, it was fun. It was dope. Um, it was, a, I, I probably, I was slow in the first half, you know, I probably took like four or five shots. And in the third quarter, I think I took one shot. In the fourth quarter, that's when I was starting. I was able to get in my groove. I got some touches. And once I seen one go in, it was, it was a wrap. How crazy is that coming from where you came from up until now winning that trophy? It's, it's, it's still surreal right now. I never ever even seen myself in a celebrity game. I would always watch and I would like, if I played in it, I'd kill. You know, yeah. I, I say, I always said that, but I was a you know, professional athlete then. I don't know, it's just, like I said, it's still surreal. It's, 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 it's an overall blessing. We talked about earlier um, how a lot of people ask both of us, you know, why don't you play in the league? Why don't you play in the D League? Why don't you play anymore? What happened? Um, I don't know, this, this kind of just took off out of nowhere. Um, it actually, when I did the Russell Westbrook video, I was on my way to go play in a in Eurobasket camp in, in, um, in Vegas. Something happened with my flight, I ended up missing it, and the very next day, that's when I made the Russell Westbrook be like. So, I mean, of course I miss it. I, got, I, I get a little different offers from overseas teams a lot. And it's always, I don't want to say it's easy to get back in it, but you know, I'm, I'm happy where I'm at right now. No wear and tear on my body, and I'm, I started something that no one else started, so. Yeah, I mean, it's a big accomplishment, and you got a ton of fans, and everybody loves it, so keep it up, and I appreciate it. I appreciate you, man.